Hi, so um, my name is Bill Raj, I'm an osteopath um, and I used to be a tennis player. I uh, played for four or five years uh, full time at the Sanchez Casalman Academy in Barcelona and um, I've been asked to make this video to show just common injuries that tennis players get, um, key areas that you normally work on as a tennis player uh, off the court in the gym where normally the shoulder evidently quite important uh, and the knees and the lower back. So uh, generally you work on the rotator cuff for the shoulder, so I'm just going to show a few exercises. So the first one would be keeping the elbow in, knees slightly bent for the internal rotators here. And we do three sets of 20, obviously you need to adjust the uh, tension of the resistance band. Um, but none of the body moves and you keep the arm in and it just goes in and out like that for 20 reps. Uh, so you do that both sides, three sets. And then the other one would be the external rotators, which are also very important. So for ease, I'm just going to swap it onto the left arm. So it would be that. Three sets of 20. And then also, you turn, you turn the grip slightly to mimic a tennis shot. And for the serve, you keep 90 degree angle here, 90, de 90 degree angle here, and you would just in and out rotating again you can see the rest of the body isn't moving and I'm just sort of pivoting around the shoulder um, there were other exercises that we did as well that were quite important for the shoulders so you work the deltoid and the supraspinatus and other muscles like that just again adjusting the tension in the band so again both sides and then just coming up and out And again, you could mimic the serve um, for the triceps and stand on the band, have the elbow as straight as possible and uh, extend. And you want the tension the whole way through. So you're almost being pulled back at the end. Um, so those are the simple shoulder exercises that we did.